Modern surgery aims to be as minimally invasive as possible, which is achieved through techniques such as laparoscopic surgery. Its method of surgery allows doctors to perform various procedures with faster recovery times and reduced complications. Laparoscopic surgery only requires a few small incisions to be made in specific areas of the body through which trocars are inserted to provide access for tools. By inserting tools and a camera through the trocars, doctors can perform a diverse range of procedures without requiring a large incision to be made in the patient's body. Pediatric surgeries greatly benefit from laparoscopic surgery as it allows doctors to minimize the risk of complications that can affect the child's growth and overall quality of life. Laparoscopic surgery is already challenging as is. The surgery requires the surgeon to conduct a 3D surgery in 2D space. In addition, training surgeons for laparoscopic surgery is a major challenge as current simulators require feedback from an experienced doctor present during the training. Our project aims to solve these problems by developing a comprehensive training system for laparoscopic surgery. With a combination of sensor data and augmented reality, we provide users with a trainer for basic laparoscopic surgery movements that provides detailed feedback. Since the tools are constrained by trocars, which allow surgeons easy access into the body, there are four degrees of freedom to consider. Roll, surge, pitch, and yaw. We have an optical sensor that monitors the tool shaft for displacements in surge and roll, and a gyroscopic sensor to measure pitch and yaw about the insertion point. Additionally, a force sensor is placed beneath each task to notify the user when they apply enough pressure that would tear tissue in an actual surgery. All sensor data are gathered via an Arduino microcontroller. The simulator makes use of augmented reality, which is the overlaying of visualizations over top of real-world imagery. It allows the blending of digital elements with a physical learning environment. It's used to provide real-time feedback to the trainee over top of the video output by showing warnings on screen regarding the trainee's hand motions. It also provides guidance during a task by visually showing and highlighting objectives. By having augmented reality, the simulator allows the user to train with less supervision from an outside expert. Once the task has been completed, users can view their feedback. On the left, it shows the amount of spikes where the user exceeded professional thresholds. A skilled professional would aim to avoid these spikes and achieve zero spikes in all measurement. Video playback and graphical sensor data with timestamps of spikes are available below to assist in reviewing previous attempts and improving performance. Overall, our surgery simulator provides users with a way of training basic movements used in laparoscopic surgery. Users can review how well they did with our user feedback and analyze how they would stack up compared to a professional.